They inform Rangers that Super 64 is down, Steel Squad is stuck behind heaps, and Somalis are bombarding them from windows. Sanderson's squad gives him cover, and he blows the window with a grenade. They all move out and get into another building. Many of them get wounded on the way. Sanderson tells Steele that they have to get to the crash site, but Steele says that their men are wounded and they have to take care of them. Sanderson asks for a squad to get to the crash site earlier. He takes Grimes along with his squad and leaves. Durant's helicopter is surrounded by civilians. A helicopter inspects them from the air and informs Matthews that two pilots are stuck. Command denies their request since they can't lose another Black Hawk. Strukers gathers everyone to leave for Durant. Hoot says, we're wasting time here. Sizemore is going with them with his casted hand. Thomas doesn't want to go back. He tells him that a soldier lives more for others and less for himself. Hoot says that their going back will increase soldiers' courage. As they're leaving, a soldier joins them, and then Thomas decides to come. He gets in the last vehicle. The convoy leaves base with little birds over their heads protecting. Galantine radios Nelson and Twombly, but they can't contact them. Eversman's squad is holding their position. Nelson and Twombly take cover of a donkey cart passing by. Yurik gets in the same street and is fired on by someone. It's Twombly. Yurik says, sorry, we almost killed you by mistake. They get together and move out. Sanderson's squad is stuck under heavy fire of technicals. As they stop to reload, Grimes takes them out with his gun rocket. A rocket hits him barely. Sanderson gets him out and they move out. Delta Force snipers Shugart and Gordon ask Garrison for permission to get to Durant on foot. The general says that you understand that we'll not be able to get you out of there until the convoy gets there. Do you still want to go there? They say they'll protect them until the convoy reaches. On a turn, McKnight's convoy's truck is attacked and a man has got a rocket in his body. They load wounded and dead. They're ordered to turn and get back to Hallwadig Road. Maddox is hit, and so is McKnight. He keeps his foot on the gas pedal to keep going. Militia surrounds Durant. He kills many of them with his minigun. A Black Hawk drops Shugart and Gordon. As some Somalis try to get very close to Durant, he takes them out. At the right time, Gordon and Shugart get to him.